shine you I know I'm so fine you blind you with each rhyme you silence is the best answer not violence it's why I bring war on the violence this is Tosh Mac TV. Please out there believe me. It's not a joke for Sheezy. You can check the CV. Don't stop watching. It's not even an option. The best show you've ever seen. I'm like, I'm not even a human being. This is the best show. Don't stop watching. It's your boy am I. We out of here. Cause I know he'll be there for the rest of my life. And some people want it all, but I don't want nothing at all. If it ain't a girl, baby. This is a shout out to Tosh Mac and Tashmac.com. Oh, oh, oh. And Shaggy. <laughs> Me love for me, the Kokoroko. I can't bother, cause I can get no greater love than you, my lord. Despite what other people want from between me and you. Hello, people, this is your girl Kefi, and you're watching Touch Magazine TV Show. Don't touch that dial. If you touch them, oh, you, oh, you, don't touch it. Enjoy. Tosh Magazine TV show, hosted by Shoggy Tosh, brings to you the best of lifestyle, entertainment, sport, films and events. Do you have a business you want people to know about? A product, a service or an establishment to talk about? Then join our list of advertising and sponsorship clients and enjoy a 50% discount for a limited period. I'm here with um, another mu musician, you know, very good at what he does, very, very good at what he does, The Waves, The The Waves. I love him so much. I'm a big fan. You know, I'm a big, big, big fan. I really enjoy what he does and introducing to you. I know you guys, we've got, th we've got three emails, you know. We put all, all of the stars that we're interviewing today, we put them on the website, but we did it a little bit late, so we got some emails, some four we didn't get. But for the waves, we got three emails, and I'll just go straight to the first, you know, question, which I wanted to ask as well. He told me off screen, but I'll let him say it himself, you know. You guys were just asking, well, what's the wave's name? Is the short for delay? You know, one question said, is it delay, you know, and then what does a wave stand for? You guys have cracked your brains, you know, trying to know the name of this guy. Why is he hiding his name? So the waves is in the building. I'll let him say hello to his fans, <laughs> and um, I hope he will tell you his name. You know, over you to know, the waves. You know, I've never said. I've never told anybody my name. Wow. Before. And it's not because I don't want to tell them. Nobody I've ever asked. You know what? Oh. I've asked people who don't even bother knowing your name. Mm. And it's that or something. Anyway, about the waves, you understand? Okay. I remember when I was in secondary school. You know when you're just that was trying in Nigeria. to in Nigeria I school in Nigeria. When you're just sorry, I just want them to know. You know, where in Nigeria? You know. The okay. Years. I grew up in Lagos. Okay. Lagos State. I live all my life in Lagos. Okay. Okay. Why well, was in Nigeria in my secondary school years? You know, when you're just prob probably in GSS 1, 2, okay. that's when you're going to be like um, trying to ask girls out. Then mm. you're going to be like to be looking cool and neat yeah. and all that. I can testify so to then that. You know? I always do something. I always have spotting waves on my head. Oh. And I, I used to do that. that. I, I'll put, you know, this. My mom, my mom's, um, uh, what is it called? <laughs> <laughs> we touch here, yeah, something yeah, like that. Yeah. I put it and I put all this, um, what is it, boom, and then use it. You know? <laughs> what? Yeah, that's what I see. So, there's no how you see me. The moment you see me, you're going to say, my God, look at this guy here. That's what's going to, the mm. first thing that's going to attract you is my hair. Okay. That's and it was very coily and was waves. So, people started calling me waves, waves, waves. So, after a while, when I started singing and okay. all that, I just realized that if I go to show, people would just say, ah, welcome on stage, waves. People would just say, waves. So, just like that, waves. Mm. You know, it, it should be swagger. Exactly, you know, though. <laughs> you have to put the swagger. You know, so I, mean, I just say, I just say to myself, ah, waves. No, I have to put something. Is it going to mm. be that waves? No, that brats. No, I don't want that. Mm. Okay, let me just do waves. The waves. And that was how the waves came about. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. I've learned a lot, you know. <laughs> it's so nice, you know, when you see these guys, you know, on stage, you know, doing their thing, you know, you know, wooing everybody. But it's so nice as when you're sitting close to them, you know. At times, you just touch them and then they just tell you secrets that, you know, are exclusives, you know. So I'm glad about that, you know. You're the CEO of um, The Waves Jam, Jams. Is it um, 
like a company of yours that produces, you know, for other artists or like you manage other people or is it just your stuff? It's just my stuff. The Wave Jam is just my stuff. But okay. I've got a record label. Okay. Yes. And the record label is called Finest Records. Okay. Finest Records. And it's that your is, record label? It's my record label. I'm not signed to anybody. I don't have a record deal with anybody. I'm doing my things wow. single addedly since I've started. But I've got couples of people that have been helping you. Okay. Know so, that's so that must mean he is, um, he's got a lot of box, you know. <laughs> People that do that, they're rich. It's you know? not easy. Nothing good comes easy, you know. That's but true. But you just have to try. That's true. As a Nigerian, you have to also struggle continuously. Mm, that's true. Yeah. Do you just want to say hello to your fans, you know? Just, I don't know. You can even sing to them whatever you want to do, you know. Just you all know the first single I dropped to you guys in 2006. It's called Omo Baby, you know. Omo Baby, to fair on me, oh. Just take it slow, slow. Oba fara bale, kogbo. My own desire. When I wake up in the morning, oh, na good Friday. I see one guy. She woke up to me. She say she know me. I saw Daniel with that girl, oh. She mentioned Niger. I no see the girl don't sabi me. Mo, oja. My bed. <laughs> my back just you are, you guys know this song so <sighs> guys it's not fair you know how can some people sing and some people can't sing <laughs> it's not fair you know it's ability you know people always say ability ability you know, there's something mm. about music let me tell you okay, yeah. go on. <clears throat> i'll tell you just just a little story about myself how okay. i started you know sometimes the, the music will be in you yeah and you won't know because probably your parents, all they want from you is just education they yeah. want you to just go to school yeah. you, that, you have to go to school you have to do this mm. When I left my secondary school, you know, I wanted to go to the university. So then I've been singing, you know, you know that was when these guys came out in Nigeria. And what is their name? Um, I think, where made this or so? Okay. That was out of secondary school. Mm. So I just was like, this guy is singing, you know. Then I would be writing songs, but I never thought I was going to sing. So it got to a stage that this group called Crazy Culture. Okay. You understand? I started okay. following them to shows, to everywhere. So when I got admission to university, I said, ah, if I follow these guys to shows, they go on the stage, they scatter the stage. Mm. They got to stage, they will invite and me. And that time, you, you was not in, you was not I into was, music. I was not into it. I never thought I was going to see. All I wanted was just to go to school, to be to manage a big company, to be a manager. Okay. <laughs> because I studied industrial regulation and personal management okay. in Lagos State University in Lasso. Okay. You know, after a while, I just realized that I, when these guys are going to do, because they go to the studio, I'll be doing a backup singer for them and all that. After that, I went to meet these guys, um, Too Fat, too Fat and Sparkle. Now, you see, they've got, this group, they've got Too Fat and Sparkle, I.D. Kabasa, Nice, okay. Lord of Ajasa. Mm. Those guys, then, you know, I actually, then I didn't know Nice. You understand? But okay. all these guys, they always go to show. I'm telling you in the early 20, 2003, 2002, okay. 2000, from 2000, 1999. Oh, anyway, okay. Yeah, huh? 1999, 2000. You know, I always go to them, we go to shows. So one day I just told them, Oh boy, I want to go to studio. I want to record mm. my thing. I you sure? I say, I've got a lot of songs that I've written. I went to the studio. Oh, so you write as well? I write my songs. Okay. I go to, but I don't produce. I just get my producers. I go to the studio. I don't record. And you know, in Nigeria, then I remember my first job that I did. Then it was, they had only one studio at Ikeja. Okay. The studio is called TFC or some TFC. You understand? And then I paid 3,000 naira for four hours, half section. Then I will never forget. Wow. And I recorded, the song was recorded, and that was when I started, how I started on my own. And I was doing show in the university, doing show everywhere. And when I came to London, you know. When was that? What, what year? Actually, I've been traveling to London, but okay. I came to stay in London in 2005. And if you don't mind me asking why, you know, because, you know, at times, like, we have artists that, that are based in London okay. and they go back to Nigeria, like Weird MC okay. and, and okay. what have you. Do you have a business you want people to know about? A product, a service, or an establishment to talk about? Then join our list of advertising and sponsorship clients and enjoy a 50% discount for a limited period.